Hey everybody, welcome back. We are here in Puerto Rico on the island of Vieques. We are just having such a fun time so far and today in this video we are going to be showing you our top beaches here on the island. We are so excited and we are going to be first starting with Sun Bay. So we'll see you when we get there. <laughs> So we made it to Sun Bay and it is so beautiful here. The sound of the waves crashing, the sunset setting off to the side, the blue skies. This is everything we could have asked for and more. We really love it here. Back in 2018, this is where we spent all of our time. So it's so nice to come back here as a married couple with a baby. So much has changed. beaches in Vieques is Media Luna. If you have kids, this is a great place to come as the water is very calm and there's not a lot of waves and they won't get freaking blown away. This is also a great place to rent a paddle board and try that out for the first time here in Vieques because the water is that calm. It's the perfect place to just go out and enjoy yourself. So this is also Arlo's first time going into the water. So this is gonna be such an amazing experience. We hope he enjoys it. So, I don't know, only time will tell. He's like, what guys, what's going on? Please tell me again. <laughs> He's like, guys, I just woke up. Please just give me a minute before we do anything. Arlo is almost ready here. Just getting the last bit of sunscreen on. You can tell he has just pure excitement on his face. Here at Media Luna, since there are really no waves here, the water is even more clear than the last two beaches we were at. So, you know, underwater snorkeling is gonna be even better here if that's what you guys wanna do. So it is a bit of a smaller beach uh, compared to the other beaches, but it's perfect. It's more of a family friendly beach. It's great to come with kids. So it's always a little more quiet than the more popular beaches. So Media Luna is one of those beaches where you have cabanas with shade and then you can also just hang out in the sun on the beach in the water. So definitely bring food, bring drinks, have a picnic and just enjoy your time here because this is a place you can spend all day in. Beach is Playa Negra, also known as Black Sand Beach. We've done this hike before and we are super excited to take you guys along with us this time. So one good thing to know is that you can either hike this trail to Black Sand Beach or you can do a horseback ride to the beach through Esperanza Riding Company. Great tour, I've done it a couple of times and you'll come right down this trail and it is so beautiful. We would have done it, but I am highly allergic to horses so that wouldn't have been a fun time for me. So definitely one thing to note is that you will encounter a bunch of wildlife out here, including geckos, you might encounter some spiders, iguanas, mongoose, anything like that. So just be aware, if you don't like any of those things, yeah. maybe think twice about coming down here, but if you're fine with it, perfectly fine to come down. So just so you guys know, this is only a five minute walk to the beach. Yeah. So you're talking 10 minutes total, really easy. And this walk is actually, it's almost like through the jungle. So it's a really fun walk, really enjoyable. So we got to Black Sand Beach 
and it is way different from the last time we were here. There's seaweed everywhere right now. The tide is higher right now, so there's just not as much sand that we can go walk on. But we found a little patch, I guess. Nicole's trying to clear the seaweed off it right now, but we're making the best of the situation. This is what it looks like. How's it going down there? I don't want to talk about it, really. We have our own little black sand beach. Bit of a bummer, but we're here. We're going to enjoy our little patch of black sand. So even though it was just a little patch of black sand, we still made the best of it. We had a really fun time. We definitely suggest coming here. It won't always look like this with all the seaweed and everything. So if you do come here, it might have changed and might even look better. We hope this list of our favorite beaches here on VAKs helps you out if you guys ever do end up visiting, which we totally recommend. You will have a blast. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, it means the world to us. And if you could like and subscribe, that would be amazing. So we'll see you guys next week. Good job.